Hello my friends, welcome back to my channel. I'm Kenneth, I'm your host who shows you around Paris and other cities every Sunday. What I want to do today is because the lockdown has been extended in Paris, I can't take you to any exhibitions or any galleries or museums, although there are a lot of posters that you saw in the opening montage in the metro for those exhibitions. So for now, the only options I have are to take you to graveyards, take you to churches, and take you to parks. So what I want to do today is take you to the fourth largest cemetery in all of Paris, that is Cimetière de Passy. We're over now by Metro Trocadero, not too far from the Twilight Fell. I want to show you some very distinguished tombs today. So we are in front of the tomb of Marie Bashkirtsev. Marie Bashkirtsev was a Russian artist who lived for only 26 years. Her tomb is one of the most ornate substructures here in the graveyard. So let's take some time and focus on what it features. So one of the principal reasons I came here today is to see the grave, uh, see the graves of two of my favorite artists, uh, Edouard Manet and Bert Morisot. I just found the grave of Manet, and I'll show that to you right now. And then we're going to go on a search for the grave of Bert Morisot. All right. So another famous grave I stumbled upon by chance is that of Princess Laila Pahlavi, the daughter of the late Shah of Iran, who tragically died at the age of 31.
So you've just passed the grave of Georges Mandel, who died in 1944 in the hands of the Nazis, who was revered as a hero of the French nation. I'm still here now for the grave of Bernard Boiseau, one of your painters I mentioned earlier. However, it is a high probability that we'll be able to find her. So that was not actually the grave of the famous painter Picabia. And I'm going to try and find the grave of Bert Moiseau. I don't know if I'll have any success because the graveyard is going to close in just an hour or so. Anyway, I'm going to try my best. And even if I don't find it, I can take consolation in the fact that I'm surrounded by some very beautiful stone masonry. There's a lot of great wrought iron metalwork here and a lot of beautiful stained glass. So, this concludes our visit to the fourth largest cemetery in all of Paris, Passy. I didn't have the chance to see all the tombs I want to see today, but this gives me an excuse to come back and next time find the graves of Bert Moiseau, the great composer Claude Debussy, the last emperor of Vietnam, and many other distinguished people. So, I hope you'll join me for my next visit. I broadcast every Sunday from Paris and other cities. Thank you once again for watching.